We're live. What channel are we on? What up, boys? What up, Gavin? Yeah, the fam and the BDGE fam. We're ready to go. What's this for? This is for Knicks Rockets. We got the animal. He's a Knicks fan. We got myself. I'm a Knicks fan. Yeah. Animal is wearing a fedora and a button-up. Outfit change, though. And a button-up. Just says NBA on it. Oh, yeah. He's a big fan of the sport. Who, who's the uh, the NFL guy? Not the NFL guy. Oh, but Rob guy. Lowe. Yeah, NFL Rob hat. Lowe had the NFL hat. What up, Chase? People are still, like, shocked that you're tall. That's what I'm saying. Well, because all my videos, I've never done, like, an impression. Right. It's just hero. Yeah. And they just, I'm very, like, soft-spoken, so they just think I'm a pipsqueak is what they're saying. <laughs> What's up, teasing the NFL? What's cracking? What's this for? We're the biggest Knicks fans you'll ever see. That's what this Are is you for. a Knicks fan? No. Oh. I'm, a, I'm a Celtics fan, but I like, I'm a realistic Celtics fan, which is hard to come by now. Yeah. Not a fan. Not, not that I'm not a fan of Jason Tatum, but like. You don't think he's legit? I think he's legit, but I think if you just walk around Massachusetts, they think he's like the second coming of Jesus Christ. Yeah. I mean. It's a tough, tough angle to take when he scored sixty like yeah. twenty four hours ago. It went to but overtime though, so I'm gonna write that one off. <laughs> I should try out for the Chargers. Yeah, where are they gonna put me? Running. Did back you ever play me. football? No, I didn't. No, just basketball and baseball. Cole Anthony. Cole Anthony hit the buzzer beater last night. Are we can do. Uh, what, what other games are tonight? We can do like some halftime, uh, halftime games or something. Yeah, I'm sure we can. Games of winning. Get, oh, yeah, yeah, give out some uh, games of skill. Yeah, and I want to talk to people, see if they have any winner or not. Yeah, we're all yeah. saying animal, animal is not participating, but we are live. This guy's got a Marcus Smart picture as his profile picture. I, I took uh, RJ over. I put it with CP3 over. I like the. Uh, You're Derek supposed Rose. to be playing on underdog code, Jack. <laughs> Derek Rose's assist line is four and a half. It's five, or did they, they just bump it? it down? I had it at four. And yeah, a half. it was four and a half. I uh, don't like that either side. It's actually eight like o'clock right now. Just because I like no reason, but yeah, it's going to be really interesting if the Knicks do end up blowing out the Rockets tonight, which they're the second biggest favorite on the slate. Who it, gets uh, eleven? Yeah. Who gets, you know, those late minutes? Like, Peyton's already losing minutes, but that's in tight games. So we'll see. There's also a really good chance that we don't blow them out. Like, yeah. I think the Rockets still have, like, a decent basketball team. Kevin Porter Jr. could just go out there and put up, like, 40 yeah, for no exactly. reason. Is Wall playing? No, he's out for the rest of the year. He just, oh, like, he, isn't playing anymore. Oh, he's just, he I quit. Like I mean, a, there's really no point. Injury. He quit? Probably, he's doing yeah. what Kenny Galladay did last year. I yeah, like post a picture of him just like getting on top of a chick and just said, Kenny Galladay? Wait, what did Kenny Galladay do? He could have came back. It's just the line suck. He, he had a hip gonna... injury for like seven weeks that he was supposed to come back from like six weeks like earlier. Every week he's like, it's like next week he'll be back. And then like he's just not coming back. Yeah, he didn't Wall has wanna... a hamstring injury with some uh, asterisk. And he's out for it. the season, yeah. <laughs> Somebody asked, where's the dude with the respectable 28 inch vert? Who's that? Nick. Does he have a 28 inch? Right? Yeah, they did the uh, the combine. Oh, the com is that good or bad? 28. Yeah. I mean, for like a regular person, that's not bad. Yeah. yeah. What do what do these freaks do? Like 40 standing? No, they're actually like not. They're impressive. But it's like Derrick Rose was, like, I think, 36 or 34. I think Zion's standing is like 38, but like running. Running is different. Yeah, you, you get, get three you get the, steps, and I think his is like a 48 or something. You but get the juice going. I think like Marcus and those guys are like low 20s because they don't actually well, have to is like, leave the ground. Yeah. That's that's not fair. I mean, I could jump higher than Marcus Hall. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> e Esports fans said Kenny G 
Galladay was grinding with his wife on Instagram. Yeah, he posted a picture. And yeah, that's like ever just saying he was he like play. he could have played. He just didn't. He knew he wasn't coming back to Detroit. Yeah. Twenty is very decent. Yeah. I feel like average for the NBA is like thirty-two Shit. and a half. I'm trying to tweet out the link. I keep I'm gonna check that after. This is like 46 and a half, I think. Your uh, little baseball uh, picks didn't yeah, mess push. up my. Uh, Trout and Otani, same amount of bags. Yeah, like I thought, walks don't count as bases. They, well, he got on base. The wording is bases. Yeah, but you guys need to understand how uh, betting or gaming. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> you gotta be a gamer. <laughs> Galladay's on the Giants. He got a big deal, too. Four years, $72 yeah. million. I wanted the Ravens to get him because he's great, obviously, contested catches and stuff. Yeah. I like Bateman, though. He's really – or Tylen Wallace, I think, was I top love of the Tyler. class in contested catches. Yeah. Is that mine? No, that's why, saying trout push. They, that's why I was surprised that he uh, is so small. I thought he was way that's taller. That's what I'm saying. When you watch him play, I thought he was built exactly like Robbie Anderson, like yeah. 6'3", real yeah. slender. But he's like 5'10", 190. He's got yeah. like a good BMI. Great right after the catch, too. I thought for sure, like, a day two pick early. Yeah. But his brother has, like, torn – or his twin brother has, like, three torn ACLs. He tore his, so they're kind of worried about that. It's like the oh. whole Michael Porter Jr. thing. Yeah. Wait, what was the Porter Jr. thing? Michael I know Porter he was Jr., hurt. His Bad. brother, his brother Jonte Porter, tore his ACL, like, twice. And then Michael Porter Jr. had a back injury. I'm not sure how that's related. Right. But they're, like, they're all fragile. Just bad genes. He was on the Cavs, right? The Cavs took him and just yeah. I'm up. still like I don't get how you just give up on guys like that. Well, so it was it was le- it was off he had off, yeah, off the court. Yeah, yeah. Well, off like, the court. He was 19 years old, and you knew that when you drafted him, right? Unless there's something crazy that I shouldn't be saying this about, but yeah, he already got suspended by the Rockets like two games ago because he fought somebody in a club. Yeah, because Bruce Brown, like or Sterling Brown, whoever's on this team, esports fan thoughts on Bucks Nets game. I was watching it on the beach a little. Um, I think the Bucks are being slept on right now. I think it's because they've never done anything in the playoffs and they're but, just being overlooked. So, so that's the craziest thing is everyone's like, they haven't done anything. And people always pin them on that. But it's like they were two games away from the NBA Finals. That's you know, true. Two I just years think ago. With Giannis in the playoffs, he's not predictable, but you know. I know. He's it's not the same shoot. thing with Lamar. It's like, but now they've got Drew who can kind of. But, yeah, overall, I just, like, it really depends where the top three seeds fall, but um, I still think the Nets win. I mean, they Giannis had 49 today, career high, made threes, I think. I think he had four yeah. or something like that, Yeah, which is kind of crazy. That's a yeah. career high. Yeah. Someone said that. I don't know if it was actually his career high. but I think uh, the All-Star game, he said his career high was like five or yeah. something Yeah, like Harden was out. And they lost by three. You know, it's just tough to see anyone beating the Nets at full strength. But that's the thing, at full strength. The argument, too, is, like, the Nets don't have any chemistry. Like, they play so much iso ball, and they can just all score that it doesn't really matter all too much. Yeah. Who do you think is the worst matchup for the Nets, the Bucks or the 76ers? Worst matchup for the Nets, I think... It's probably it's probably even because Embiid and Giannis will do the same thing in the paint, and then defensively, which is how you probably limit them, is the Sixers and the Bucks are both elite defensive teams. I don't know if I, the one thing is like I think Giannis can neutralize a lot. <laughs> Your shirt. Is it the influencer one? Yeah. <laughs> um, I think Giannis just being back there with Lopez is, I don't know. Like, who does, like, Simmons is their best defender, right? But who of the Nets three do you really think that Simmons, like, like, they're just. Who do you think that they're going to leave on an island? Because Embiid's probably, actually, he can't guard fucking Kevin Durant. Right. So I don't know. That's that's what I'm saying. They don't, they funnel guys into Embiid. Yeah. But you don't. Like, I Next actually think Drew Holiday there. and Middleton can guard. Like, Tybal, he could guard. He's the problem is you can't fucking guard any of them. Yeah, he's you such know? a liability offensively, too. Like, Chris Middleton and Drew can get buckets on the other side of the court. I don't know. It's going to be fun. The East hasn't really been a fun conference to watch in the playoffs in a long time. 
Yeah, no, it should be it should be good. Yeah, it's either been like LeBron or then like last year was decent, but it was also in a bubble COVID year. Everything was kind of yeah. out of whack. Yeah. Knicks Rockets. Somebody asked if we're collecting basketball or football cards. You um, got a take on that? I, I've, I've uh, not been buying any basketball or football cards recently. Um, I've obviously been buying Top Shot stuff. You're a Top Shotter, right? Yeah. Um, Losing a whole lot of money, but having fun in the process. Yeah. But I, I think with physical cards, I think it's a really good time to buy football. As the season is hyping up, and then I would say vintage basketball is strong. I wouldn't buy much modern. Like, if you want to buy Michael Porter Jr., probably buying Top Shot moments makes more sense. If you want to buy Tim Duncan and Shaq, then you can buy sports cards. Are you on dibs at all or no? Uh, I am on dibs. Is I think it it's correlated interesting. to the actual card market, or it's just like that's its own market? Is it uh, it's supposed to be, but it it's not as efficient. Hold on, I'm, I'm up making my last selection here. Amari Rogers. All right, I just drafted the winning best ball team. Congratulations to myself. One million dollars. Yeah, why did that take so long? You've been down for like 20 minutes. Yeah. Uh, no, no, no Knicks yeah. games start like 10 to 15 minutes after when they're supposed to. So it'll start in the next couple of minutes. Minus ten and a half. Seven and a half to line? Oh, ten. Yeah, I, wouldn't, I don't know if I would lay that. Yeah. Yeah. Let's go Heat. Knicks always choke. They're not even playing each other today. Yeah, I don't know what that means. But, I mean. In the playoffs, maybe 4-5? or five? Nah, the Heat. I I think the Heat are going to be in the play, and honestly. They have such like, a good team on paper, but Tyler Hero's like. Hero's been terrible today, recently. Um, he's just not that good. Tall Bryce Hall. Damn. <laughs> they should have Bry- kept Kelly Bry- Linux. Bryce Hall with a jump shot. I mean, look, no one's worse than Alfred Payton. This is what I'm saying. Like, that's it. I mean, it's not a great five. Well, but Linux been like hot since he got. If there. you if you preseason captured that, like just those five, you would have said it's probably an even matchup. Probably, yeah, because Julius Randle is, what, like a 20? Right, and and RJ was not great, and Alfred Payton stinks, and Reggie Bullock is nothing, (laughs) and Nerlens is a a backup center. Didn't he turn down, like, four years, 70 million one time, and he tried to, like, bet on himself, and now he's just all over the place? Yeah. Nerlens, when he was on Dallas, I think. What did he try to? He turned down four years, 70 million. Yes, yes, he did. Uh, he's been actually spectacular for the Knicks this season. We were watching at uh, Animal's house. He had like four or five blocks on yeah. Tuesday. Yeah, and Wednesday. like three steals or something. He was locking up. Yeah. Since when is Kelly Olenek best friends with all the Knicks? Sure. Are we streaming? We are. We are live, <laughs> we are live and direct watching the Knicks. What do you know about the... Uh, yeah, someone's got to explain this basketball to me. <laughs> <laughs> I know he went to Duke. There you go. Correct. 
How do you know that? And that he was the uh, second guy to Zion, but he's coming into his own. From he was Canada. actually rated higher, higher as a recruit. recruit. Yep. Yeah. It's funny, not to interrupt this game already, but I'm from North Carolina, so I grew up with like the Duke Carolina rivalry. Yeah. But now, nice. I just have no time. Like it's something that doesn't impact my daily life, so I probably watch three college basketball games a year. Wow. When I used to be so into it. You watched the national championship? I did. But, I, I mean, I was really into, like, the J.J. Redick, Chris Duhon. Yeah. Sheldon Williams, years of Duke. Ah. So, so RJ's really good at getting to the rim, and he's still, like, not a great finisher. He got better this year, but. You know who's like that, too? Jason Tatum, if you watch the Celtics, gets to the rim and never yeah. makes his laps. Yeah. And it's really weird. When you're that height, too, and he's, like, a pretty strong guy, yeah. like R.J. Barrett. He's, um, so it's why, like, I think we have a lot of promise for him, but also it's concerning that he can't finish that well, but yeah. now he's, like, decent around there. It's weird. Jack, here's a question. Yeah. So, so many young guys come into the league, and immediately they're amazing. So, how does someone like Julius Randle take so long to become amazing? He got hurt right off the bat. I think he broke his leg and he was out for a year I, and a half. I would say part of it is some people take a little longer to develop. And then I would say part of it is also scheme fit. Um... You actually see it with guards a lot, point guards in the Long NBA. Sure. Yeah, take a while to develop. And now, like you said, like Ja comes in and at 19, he's, he's a superstar. Right. And then, so people give up on like Lonzo. I mean, even De'Aaron Fox, he's obviously now on a max deal, but like people had concern for him. I mean, RJ Barrett, 10 games into the season, he was terrible. Like, I'm not going to no. lie, he was terrible. People want him sent to the G League. Like, he was really? playing that poorly, and he was 19, and he was just in a shooting slump, and now he's averaging, you know, 21 a game over the last 10. And Randall and came he, in when he was 19, too, right? Yeah, Randall was super young. But what, this is like his seventh year? Oof. Probably. I just made that number up. Yeah, it's six or seven he for came him. came in with Wiggins, right? Uh, Randall? No, no. He was a – Wiggins is way, way older. Not way, but he was like 2012 or something. You sure? I think yeah. Randall, Randall is six or seven. So Randall would have been 14. Maybe Wiggins was 13. But I do think they're a different draft. Yeah, it was either him or Aaron Gordon. I just remember, like, they all had the same year yeah. in high school. They had crazy highlights. Yeah. There's Christian Wood. Yeah, Randall was 2014, 2015 as a rookie. Yeah. Was Wiggins 12, 12 or 13? No, same year. 2014, 2015. Really? Yeah, I think it was... Those two and Jabari Parker. Mm. Oh, I remember that name. An another. I actually have a. Three, I have a three, bet three with a now. friend on my phone. He bet me that Jabari, Jabari Parker would win an MVP in his career. <laughs> <laughs> you can't cash it yet, huh? You can't cash it. In yet. Australia, I know, and he won't pay me until <laughs> in he retires. Spain or what? <laughs> <laughs> um, and and the the worst part is. It's so bad that he doesn't believe that, <laughs> he that it ever happened. But I literally wrote it down. Those are like the most fun ones. If you write down on bad and that. Because you never think like seven years later you're going to actually check. I have one with my buddy, uh, Virgil van Dijk. He's a Liverpool fan. And I said two, I forget what it was. It was either two or three years from now he won't be one of the best center backs in the league. And this was when, like, he allowed zero dribbles in right. an entire season. And, I mean, he's torn his ACL. Correct. And, yeah. It's just like... Allowed he, seven goals to Aston Villa. Right, right, right. So when you're in the moment, you think, yeah, how could... I mean, I'm sure people would have said the same about Michael Thomas. Yeah. Who's the best receiver in football. Yeah. Odell. Most, yeah, Odell, same stuff, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, we were talking about running backs earlier, and obviously their careers fall off a cliff immediately. And as soon as they start going down, they're gone. Yeah. Like Devontae Freeman's the latest example of that. Yeah. You know, two years ago, he was Girly. awesome. I mean, 
Girl is thought wild. 365 days ago, if you said Mike Davis was considerably better than Le'Veon Bell and Todd Gurley. Right. And now you're correct. Right. Josh, we're not going to let you hijack this Sorry. basketball stream with your football takes. <laughs> football analogies. That's for tomorrow. <laughs> football analogies. Everyone's saying Michael Thomas is in top five. Yeah, clearly he's not top Should five. Should we rank him? But he was, right? Oh, yeah. He was top five wide receiver. What corner called him Slant Boy? Did you see that this yeah, year? His yeah. own teammate. Everyone calls oh, him Slant Boy. Was his own teammate? Yeah. No, that's a rumor. It that was not proven cr- true. Was the guy that, I think uh, it was someone on Twitter. Yeah. No, no, no. Was it's it Jalen Ramsey Call him Slant Boy? I don't know if it was. Was it a player in the league? Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. No, it was probably. Wait, Lattimore's on his team. Johnson so. Gardner Johnson? Yeah. Yeah. No, that's the guy I think that was the, Wims punched in the mouth. Yeah. Yes. The that's, the that's the rumor is that he caught him that in practice. That wasn't confirmed. But there was a wide receiver or a corner who called him that. Was it Jenkins? Malcolm Jenkins? No, because they were teammates. I think it was a young guy. Yeah. Maybe the chat will know. Somebody said Devontae Parker is better than MT. Thoughts? Uh, when no. in Miami. So, but from a fantasy perspective, like, Thomas, people aren't high on him this year, are they? Well, just not, not, in, con, not in comparison to, like, where they were a couple of years ago. Because he was the first but wide now receiver now it gets even more of a downgrade with the quarterback situation, right? Well, we're hoping for Jameis. Because he'll, he'll throw it even when. Ha- well, second no half of the season, it could happen, right? It could happen in the first half. You think? Is there two still Traquan Smith? Yeah, he, that's their... I hate that. He's was been like everybody's it, I thought he was good, yeah. Four years. Are you going to participate in this stream? Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, just, I wasn't sure if it was second half or first half when, you're, when the animal was going to join us. That's exciting. Yeah. The, I'm curious, Jack. The person who said that Michael Thomas isn't top five, who is his top five? Yeah, esports fan. We got to ask you uh, who your top five wides are. And AJ Brown better be in there. Fantasy Twitter loves AJ yeah. Brown. T.O. Oof. Terrell Owens. That's what they compare him to. Oh, no. Oh, is that Christian Wood? Wood? Yes, sir. Oh, dear. That doesn't look good. That's tough. For injuries, by root for the Knicks. So, <laughs> what about my pickums that have Christian Wood overs? I have Christian Wood overs. Oh. Someone say that's not a sharp. Oh, damn it, that's not good. That was at the end too. Fuck. Are you kidding? How many was that? Uh, Avery Bradley. I'm just going to start calling yeah, out NBA yeah, names yeah, that yeah. I know. <laughs> it is. That's that's my role on this couch. You so so, Kevin Porter Jr. You know him. Um, did he go to Kentucky or Colorado? USC. Nope, I don't know him. Christian Wood. Yeah, I don't know who that guy. Is. Avery Bradley. I know Jay Avery Bradley. Sean Tate. Around? No. Kelly Olynyk. Yeah, you know Kelly. Yeah, he's bounced around the league. Nick starters. Alfred Payton. Yeah, long, he used to have really big He used to have hair. the fro, not even a fro, like the magic? some ridiculous, yeah, yeah. I used to play NBA 2K, that's how okay. I know. Reggie Bullock? Yeah, UNC? He went to UNC, RJ, Randall, and Nerlens Noel. Got it. Where'd Silas? And now Nerlens is good too, right? Nerlens has been, I mean. Great defense. defense. Yeah, yeah. Like he's become a specialist, I guess. Yeah. Yeah, he gets like, does he have four blocks every game? Because it feels like he does. I think every time you watch, he gets All in the chat, here's your top five yeah, yeah, from eSports it. fan. Tyreek, Diggs, who's Donkey Kong? DK. Uh, <laughs> uh, Nuke and Devonta. And he said A.J. Brown's close. I mean, the issue with naming a top five wide receiver is that ten people should be on the list. Right. You know? Yeah, it's going to change every single season. I love that Diggs is on there, though. Jefferson or Michael Thomas? Are you asking us? 
Everyone. So like this is. I the, hate Michael the Thomas. The thing with these questions, like from a dynasty perspective, it's not even close. No, 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 no saying, one like, right season, now, Max. Yeah, yeah, this season, not not even not even fantasy. Just yeah, in terms yeah. of like play who's at the a position. better player? Yeah. I'll still probably. All right, yeah, Jefferson or A.J. Brown? I'm taking A.J. Brown. I love A.J. Brown. Really? Yeah. A.J. Brown's a better player. A.J. Brown got shut Brown. the fuck down after the first quarter of the playoff game. I still love A.J. Brown. But, like, why does he go silent? They just don't throw enough. I mean, they were 32nd or but near they the bottom did, in terms I mean, of pass attempts. Yeah. Nick with a hot take here. Byron Pringle, top five. I mean, that's... <laughs> Ooh, all right. If you said top 15, he could have had me. All right. <laughs> where, where do you rank Calvin Ridley in terms of straight up just wide receiver? My seat? brain is still processing, and obviously it's true, having him over Julio now. You know, because for so many years he was the second guy. Yeah. But now obviously he's, he's been wide receiver one. I mean, he, he's on the – it's the Stefan Diggs, Calvin Ridley, Jerry Judy spectrum. You know, like they're all similar types. Yeah. But then – Calvin has shifted over to the yeah. alpha side. Yeah. Who do you think his talents, Jefferson and Ridley, are comparable? Yeah. Yeah. I mean, they're, like they're just really Brown, good. From just like an athletic tool standpoint, is in a different category. Isn't it wild that all these wide receivers that were tiny this year, I mean, they were 6'1", yeah. 170, 180 pounds two years ago, three years ago. We had A.J. Brown and D.K. Metcalf going round two right. as these 6'2", 230 phenoms. Right. Do, is, is Metcalf a consensus top five wide receiver? No, probably no, not. I don't think he is. He's the, I'd take A.J. Brown over D.K. Metcalf. D.K. Metcalf is like the quintessential use case for how would he be with another quarterback. And I always compare, like, would... DK Metcalf have had the season Cortland Sutton did with Drew Locke last year. You know, it's um. DK's development is fascinating. Uh, animal, there's OC one that's, the buttons clicked on. Screwed one of them. them at yeah. Ole Miss. Absolutely screwed them because he just put them on one side. But then when he was drafted by Seattle, yeah. they did that They'd for the first four to six weeks and then, like added little bits and pieces onto his game. Like, okay, now you can, you know, run more alignments from the right side of the formation or run more routes from the slot, and then they just added more and more, and now he's a complete wide receiver. Josh, how high you have A.J. Brown this year? He's, I mean, are we talking like 130 targets, A.J. Brown? 140 I'm, targets, I'm, A.J. I'm Brown? talking how, whatever you think is going to happen with A.J. Brown. You have the ADPs in front of you? What about Allen Robinson in terms of skill? Allen Robinson, where is he rank in that whole group? A-Rob, Allen Robinson. I mean, he's really good. He's done it for a long yeah, time, too. With, with no, no one. one. Yeah. Listen, I'm not going to fault you for going A.J. Brown as high as, like, three if you wanted to. That's He's number four right now. It's Adams, Hill, Diggs, A.J. Brown at 18, wide receiver four. Do I we think, think, that's, a, do we I think that's correct? Do I think we think Devontae fair. Adams, where, how really far has he dropped without Rodgers? Without Rodgers? <laughs> Huh? Just so far down. Really? Yeah. I mean, so, we know so nothing about Jordan Love. We haven't even seen a preseason game with Jordan Love. You think he falls like very, very far? He becomes like an early fourth rounder, probably late third. That's rounder. blasphemous. That might be. I, I would probably take him around. Well, I need to see the ADPs, but probably around like twelve. Devontae like, Adams twelve with Jordan Love. Like wide receiver twelve. Oh, okay, okay. I thought you meant twelve overall. I was like, really? Gosh, get off the stream. I mean, Jordan Love might just suck. But, Devon, but but if Nuke's been a wide receiver one, Allen Robinson's been a wide receiver one, even with bad quarterbacks. Wide receiver 12 would put him. Isn't Devontae Adams the best route runner put him in, end the, of the, third in the world? That's a great question. I mean, that guy's just a, a, What does Steph Curry do better than R.J. Barrett? Because it's okay. not shoot the basketball. I, I think How this much is a better range. <laughs> wide receiver 8 to wide receiver 12, I okay. think would be fair. 12 puts him at like the end of the third round. Yeah, yeah, that's about right. But there are dudes like, it's like Terry, Tyler Lockett's somehow in the thirty-six range. I like how this is animals Nick stream. Right, Not he's a, yeah. Sorry, guys. I mean, the chat did request football, so oh, they did. yeah, 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 yeah. Ooh.
Diggs or Devontae for route running? I mean, they're both great. I don't get, like, why. Is it because people want to make, like, the guy who wasn't over the, like, isn't Devontae Adams clearly runner. the best route runner? I feel like, like Devontae Adams, they're both great, but Devontae Adams is more a product of his rapport with Aaron Rodgers than Diggs, who we've now seen it do do it with two different quarterbacks. <sighs> do you know what Diggs reminds me of? And I don't watch a lot of basketball, but he just makes ISO moves at the line of scrimmage every time in his releases. Right, right. I mean, yeah. Well, th- there is the video the where it looks like he's doing it between the lat. Yeah. yeah. He's the best in the league at it. Yeah. How was, how much uh, Josh Allen success gets credited to Diggs coming in to everybody? Dayball? Because what Dayball did so good was say it's okay if you make some mistakes. Right, like, we're gonna live with the roller coaster. Right, because Allen's like a pedal to the floor guy. But then what they did last yeah. year was run a lot of like ten personnel, so four wide receiver sets. They did that more in the first two weeks of last season than they did all of twenty nineteen. Right. So Dayball is just great in terms yeah. of – because but what ha- realized but what, was if, if you just ask Josh Allen to do this typical drop back stuff over right. and over and over again, why not spread it out? And then if he wants to run to the right side of the line, right. run to the left side of the line, run up the field, right. there's more space to do it. Right. I don't I think, think the, so. Uh, washing machine. Derrick Rose has entered the basketball game. One assist on the board. There you go. Four more. Does does RJ just have those two threes? Uh, from what I remember. Ooh. That decapitated. <laughs> Esports fan says we need the professional lounger to join us. <laughs> Animal's on his way. <laughs> Jay Salad said, no, it looks like if Hercules stopped juicing. <laughs> <laughs> he said, I look like if Jesus wasn't religious, too. <laughs> Poor dude. This guy can't make free throws. Wow. The youngest to score 50? Yeah. Who do you think? Uh, Devin Booker, because he's still 17. All right. Chat. Kevin Porter became the fourth youngest player to score 50 points. Who is the youngest? And let's see if we can name the three younger. How old do you think Kevin Porter is right now? 20? 21? He's maybe he's 19. Old 19. I would say... uh, Booker, I think Booker. Uh, he put up seventy on the Celtics. Yeah, that was he was twenty-one probably. I, I'll say Kobe probably yeah, did it. Like high school guys, I would assume. Garnett. Mm, Fifties a lot. I yeah, fifties. Yeah, it's a different level. Like uh, LeBron's career high is. It's like fifty-nine. Yeah, I don't even think he's touched. Think he, yeah, I don't what, think he did that. Super um. Bad. So I actually don't think LeBron would be on that list, but I think Kobe probably is on the list. MJ, no, because he was in college for a while, so maybe not. Durant? Uh, Durant. One year at Texas? I don't, yeah, I don't. Derrick Rose? I mean, they're playing against Not D. Rose. And what do you know? But who's the, the question really is, is who's the actual youngest? Youngest to score 50 in an NBA game. Yeah, that was nice. Yeah, Porter Jr. is not kind of the fourth youngest. He's fourth youngest. Esports fan says... Uh, Our guesses are Kobe, Kevin Garnett, Devin Booker. How Kevin Porter Jr. right now? I'd say 20 or Nice 21. pass. His second year in the league, and he went to USC for a year. That's what we were thinking because he came out of high school. Yeah. Esports fan says LeBron's on the list. I really don't think he's on the list. I feel that's too obvious of an answer for them to ask for that. I, he's definitely not the youngest. What about uh, Bernard King? <laughs> Did he score like 60 on Christmas Day? Ooh. Could be Bernard King. I mean, they normally get a Nick into the trivia question in some form or fashion. D. Rose. Could be. And one. Yeah, I could see D. Rose. I like that. I'm 
go with D Rose. Maybe Kenyon Martin because his kid is on the team right now, <laughs> out there playing. Really? Yeah, Kenyon Martin Jr. is on. I the mean, Rockets. this NFL draft screwed me up. Yeah, in terms with the of sound my, day and all the timeline. Patrick Sertan Jr. That's a highlight. <laughs> Frank Gore's kid's about to be in the NFL. Where's he at? Like Southern Mississippi, Missouri, or something? One of those small schools. Maybe yeah, FAU. Yeah. I'm, I'm making it. Up. Oh, Frank Gore's kid. Yeah, he's at, yeah somewhere like that. Where'd Gore go? Miami. Huh? Gore went to Miami. Yeah. Was he? He played with uh, McGahey and Portis. Right? He's working on. Frank Gore in college. Yeah, he. That was. That was Frank Gore, it was Najee Davenport, and it was Willis McGahee. There was one more running back in that group, and I can't Clinton remember Portis. who it is. It was Clinton Portis, I think. There you go. Yeah, number six is Kenyon Martin's kid. What do you mean? Huh. Number six is, oh, oh. Kenyon Martin Jr. I think he meant six youngest to score 50. Yeah. I'm like, Kenyon <laughs> Martin's kid has <laughs> not scored night. 50 in a game. Animal, do you watch every Knicks game? With 90 percent. 80%. 80%. Who's your favorite player? I don't always watch the beginning. I usually come in the quarter. Who's your favorite player? Randall. Randall? Yeah. Who's your least favorite player? That would be Alfred Payton because I was, I was on him <laughs> so much in the beginning of the year. Do you see his tweets? He has Alfred Payton over 12 and a half points almost every game. He's just always at like <laughs> 7, 8 points. I think he's averaging eight 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 I wonder why the odds are so juicy. <laughs> you're keeping FanDuel's pockets filled. I love that you said you're you come in in like the second quarter as if you're like one of the Miami Heat fans we were talking about. Like, yeah, we're just having dinner, cocktails rolling. But not to mention, not to mention, there's actually a stream for me and him to watch the next <laughs> game. He joins like two minutes ago in the first. So in the beginning, I'm usually doing other shit and trying to catch up, and then I can you know settle down, relax. Yeah, settle down, man. Have yourself a night. Yeah, I'm waiting. We got food on the way. We went with Jamaican, by the way, instead of the wings. No, you guys were excited. I tweeted we might get wings. So uh, there's no Jamaican wings. Chat is pissed that you lied to them about dinner. <laughs> he only has one. Uh, four and a half was the line. He's at one right now. Nice finish. I'm very curious what the Knicks offense will look like when... Lonzo Ball's running the show. Dame. But, no, when, like, they play, like, playoff caliber defenses. Because, like, over the last 10 games, they have been scoring with ease. And if you watch the first 50, they won games because they were playing great defense. Now it's like they can outscore teams. It's really bizarre. Ours has been lighting it up. We for the playoffs. Like, if we play good defense and keep the scoring going. Yeah, but, yeah. It's just going to come down to whether or not RJ can keep playing, like, you know, not like that. But I mean, that was the end of shot, get though. Bad shots out in the regular season. 48% last month. Let's keep that going. Yeah. <laughs> Let's have him be the greatest three-point shooter ever. I have Rose. RJ, Rose, and Bullock, I guess. What's Bullock? 11 now? 12 and a half points. I don't think he's even shot yet. He's wide Where open. He he's wide open on the wing. Ooh. Money. Ready. That's a low arcing three. Yeah. <laughs> I, was just out. I should give him some lessons. Boy, Olinick is just fumbling it. Yeah, I like those uniforms. Is that for like the Oilers? Like a, a shout out? That's a good question. They've been rocking the light oh, blues. The NBA, they always have like just like a random. Yeah, like uh, Milwaukee's Milwaukee's like cream jerseys. It doesn't say like Cream City on the front. Yeah. They had to rethink that. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Cream City. Is that Jared Jeffries? Free go. IQ. What? You need a Reggie? You have him. 
Yeah. Oh, I like one of these guesses. Somebody said Brandon Jennings. That, that could be a oh, decent. That's a good one. That could be a decent one. OJ Mayo, Brandon Roy. Played one year at LSU, probably yeah, like twenty. Twenty, he might not be Putting on fifty is a big man. D Rose, that's huge. You think D Rose? You think D Rose the youngest ever? Yes, he really. Be tough I do really. Sure. I think that's heavy. It makes sense with the mix and everything last year. Well, he put up fifty on Minnesota after he got back. Yeah, he did, but he was like thirty. Yeah. <laughs> I think it was like a bigger celebration than when he won. All right, here we go. RJ Barrett, six points. Randall, 10, 4, and 3. Uh, Bullock has five. For the Rockets, Porter is five. Olenek, 6, 3, and 3. That's pretty much it. Freak out. No way. Did he really? I believe it. He probably like shot the ball seventy times. That's just the player he was. The guy does like to shoot. Yeah, he was. He did like to shoot. And we want this. Or do you want this? I don't care. Well, is this. Uh, I think he's from New York too. BJ? Boy. Yeah, he might be. <laughs> that fuck. Yeah, J J Sal, not today. I can't do it tonight. Blowing your kiss. Give me one night off. Just everything is just like his all his comments like animal looks like animal and it's like this one's animal shirt so tight it looks like his belly button is throwing us a kiss. <laughs> Damn it. He's saying he dropped fifty against Steph Curry as a rookie, Brandon Jennings. Really? History what up, Braden? What's popping? What line should I be looking at now? Where it's Knicks are up to plus fourteen and a half, or uh, minus fourteen. And a half. Yeah, is it minus ship, one ten? The ship might have sailed. Yeah. They just showed it on the screen. Jennings is from Compton. I was way off. All I want to do is feel something with the sweat guy. <laughs> What's uh? Do they have like R.J. Barrett points? What's this mean? Uh, I can share it. Yeah, oh, I, it I can do it. Is that a basketball shot? It might be the address, but I don't want to say. Yeah, but right I here. completely disagree with. Those. What's it mean? He's saying that he likes his teams to be three quarterbacks, six running backs, six wide receivers, three tight ends, which is like a very non-fragile, that's like giving yeah. yourself safety at every position. Right. That's like a 12 man, right? Where I'd rather be skinnier at a position or two and then be... Like, I, I like having eight wide receivers in a lot of drafts if I'm going running back early. Come on, Rowan. Come on, Rowan. Cook that man. Cook that man. Yup. 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 Nope. Does he go up with his right at all or no? Yeah. He does. Yeah. Should have taken it there. Yeah. Nah, he's got that move in his in his arsenal. Woo. What a shot. Is that Jay Shot? Who is that? No, uh, it's uh, like Daquan Jeffries or something. He's the best player on the Rockets. Christian Wood. He's Obadiah Toppin, bank oh it. That's our that's our number six pick. Big. That's our number six pick. Who who should they have taken in hindsight? Halliburton. Yeah. What was the knock on Halliburton? Uh, his tall. shot was funky. Oh yeah. Sadiq but Bay has like a but, very but, similar release. But it just didn't make like, but the ball constantly went in the hoop, so <laughs> it made no sense. Yeah, no, Obi's, Obi's been actually much better over the last 10 games now that he's spending more time in the paint. But Obi Tobin is how old? 24, probably. Yeah. Okay, there. I was going to say he yeah. looks like he's 35. Yeah, he's yeah. an older. Yeah. Jason Tate's 25 as a rookie. Really? He played in, like, Australia for a few years, or New Zealand, one of the two. Yeah. <laughs> Sick. 
salad's fucking hilarious. He was on fire. We gave away. We were doing giveaways for the best roast, and when that yeah. happened, he just went silent. I feel like he's just a man. So of people animal like looks like away. the guy that says, "Come on, girl, we're only related by marriage." <laughs> yeah, he said his parents look like they're related. <laughs> it's quality. It's quality. He should have. He should have seen Animal at the beach club today. He was in his element. He was looking like a snack. Balancing drinks on his stomach, while reclining. <laughs> I have no clue what that means. Someone, someone commented, "Sausage party." As if most uh, watch yeah. streams are, <laughs> yeah, we got hella, hella girls. The chat got so spoiled by the last few streams having some girls yeah, in the background. Yeah, in the background, yeah. Ninety-nine <laughs> of all of BDG content is a sausage party. <laughs> <laughs> you guys want to play for, pay for a professional lounger? You can. Seriously. All right, Obi. Ah. Take. Yeah. Oh, Tatum is 24 at the half. That's cool. After uh, Noah, Noah's start to the stream, was this guy's not that good? <laughs> I was just trying to establish that I'm not like a wild Celtics fan. Yeah, player. yeah, yeah. Shit. What's wrong, buddy? You know who's always like disrespected too is DeMar DeRozan. This year is averaging like over the past month, like probably in close to the 30s, and his yeah. lines are always like 32 and a half for total. Yeah, points, rebounds, assists. That's an easy one, easy hitter. From what I've the seen, the night he's playing the Sixers though, so I wouldn't be. I think he's out tonight, or I didn't see him in the box gotcha. score. Yeah, he is. He is out. Seth Curry with 11. It's 71 71 at the half between the Celtics and Trailblazers. Yeah. What right. up? We'll have that up for halftime. After halftime. Ew. All right. I mean, we're looking good here, right? Up 10? Yeah. No, nah, the, uh, the Rockets are. They're just. It's weird. Like, they. Spraying. Floater. Freeze. They, uh. They have decent players, but they're they terrible. No it, yeah, it must be that. But they're god awful. They're like all ten day guys, other than Christian Wood and Olenek. Yeah, Wood Wood was a guy that uh, Knicks fans really wanted. I don't know I why was, nobody wanted to pay him. Yeah, I was so so on fans. him because he really only had like a thirty game stretch where it was great second half of last season. But then the con- like because I thought he was gonna get like four for eighty. Yeah. He got like what ten or twelve million yeah, or something. Super low. Yeah, and I was like, "Damn, that's crazy steal." Yeah, the Pistons didn't pay him, and then they gave yeah. Jeremy Grant like twenty a year. Well, and that turned out it's to be good, but the, well. they gave like Plumley his contract size. They gave Terrible. they signed like eight centers. Now they brought in uh, Dennis Smith Jr. Just trying to revive that guy's career. Yeah, no, he's he's about as bad as they got. <sighs> RJ's got six. Derrick Rose has eight points, four rebounds. Does that mean he has no assists? I think he only has the one assist. He's got two. He's got two assists. He's got two dimes in the first half? We need four and a half, so. Okay. Yeah, underdog uh, promo code not Pete, and um, (laughs) you can uh, get $25, right? You talk to the devs, right? That reroutes to yours. (laughs) Not (laughs) Pete. I think after this weekend, it's going to be promo code not feet. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> yeah. Actually, this, uh, this brand is a big feet, big feet brand. Big feet brand. Here you go. D Rose on the fast break. Ooh. That's a good pass. Oh. Uh, I think this is my first time watching quickly play. Uh, there the you go. That's the, Ooh, you like what you see? It. That's the I'm Emmanuel. The market, <laughs> Let's go. Okay. That's the. That was sick. Yeah. No, he that's, like, that's what he does. Yeah, yeah, he has so much confidence. He's about to pull it from the yeah. logo too. That to, was a confident shot. Right yeah, there. no, that that I'm not even kidding though. I think that's the first time I've seen him make it like a sidestep <laughs> three like that. 
Like even that. Oh, there was we go. Ambitious. He's, going, he's going for an O. Oh. And one. Up, there it is. Had he played? No, he he's actually probably is the smartest player on the Knicks in terms of like drawing fouls, like as a <laughs> rook. Wow. Yeah, that was dope. The coach doesn't love that shot. But. No, they uh, Tibbs was actually talking about it yesterday. They have a four point line in practice, Ooh. and quickly Young Tony. Like, they tell him to shoot from the four point line in transition. Like he's that good of a shooter. Thank you. What? <laughs> Wait, did Tony get beer? No. I think he got. I don't know if it's illegal. I think he's about to smoke or something. Ah. Then again, how you don't have to like get ID'd if it's illegal. So yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he, he, he got handed Jamaican food. It's like, sir, sir, it's not that spicy. <laughs> Yeah, Woods, we got time, Braden. Woods got some time to cook. Don't worry. It's the the thing with betting the pickums on the on the Rockets Knicks stuff is who's playing in the second half. Yeah, it's gonna be a lot of like, garbage time here. Yeah, but like everyone's garbage. So. <laughs> um, but yeah. yeah, like Randall should get some minutes off. RJ should maybe get some minutes off outside of that. Like, and the Knicks also can't, like, they'll have to be up 25 late for, for guys yeah. to get pulled. They can't risk losing this one. Yeah, Tom, especially with Tom. Tom yeah, doesn't, he doesn't he'll fuck do around. He'll, he'll, he, he makes everyone, yeah. Yeah. everyone play no matter what. Yeah. Yeah. I love It's great yeah. for, um, for gaming because for you, uh, for, <laughs> that's what we were just yeah. talking about. Yeah. Cause you, it's like you know you can actually rely on. That's what I got killed the other uh, night with a Jokic uh, game. Oh uh, yeah, I had, you got benched. You right? know, twenty four point, twenty five points, and uh, them to win. He had like twenty four in the third, and he just didn't play the rest yeah. of the game because they were up like. Yeah. That happens with Zion a ton. He also only plays like twenty eight minutes a game. Yeah, it's very annoying. Nice. Okay. Oh, Great that can't play. happen. Wow, he didn't even try to pass it. <laughs> yeah. just, like, in midair, he just knew he was like he so just disappointed. He's just like, ah, oh, fuck. <laughs> Any chance we get first half plays? I know uh, some of the other gaming apps do the first half plays or even second half plays. Pro influencer, quickly. other Way gaming deep. apps. <laughs> <laughs> um, I, yeah, I would imagine that they would they would put I've that. I've been in. looking at the lines. I'm trying to find yeah. a good entry point here. I don't even like the 17 and a half after hearing you guys say that Tibbs isn't going to take the feet off the gas. You do or don't? Don't. Yeah, that scares me. Which side? The it betting uh, Houston. I was trying to get a yeah. big fat Houston number, yeah. and that scares me now. Yeah. No, they stink. Like, yeah, I mean, very, very bad. I mean, they're getting posted by Taj Gibson in the year of 2021. <laughs> I mean, you're just not. That's not a was good sign. Thibodeau. I mean, Gibson. Uh, He's been with him like his entire Bulls, career. Right? Yeah. Got a chance? He's got a... Uh, 30 and a half today. I said I took it. I do not like Anthony Davis at any number. Yeah, he's been, he's been shit, but 23 and a half. It's right in the kitchen right there. I just put it on the table. Yeah, dive Did in. you tell Jeremy and them? Yeah, I told him. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, let me know what's looking, looking good. <sighs> I, like, um, I want it to be Pete approved before we I also, have any. Let's see, what? So I want it to be Pete approved before I have any. Let's see. Uh, there is a 10 p.m. game. So depending on how we're looking, we may need to fire. It's Lakers-Raptors. Yeah. I was oh, I just saw yours. Yeah. Oh, you actually just put that in? 
I put and that in like, right when I was getting Siakam. in the shower. There's five. There's five available over unders. What do you like? Siakam, thirty and a half. Thirty and a half. You guys percent. love taking his I, over. I love small forwards that can like get assists and rebounds. Yeah, because they just got to score. And it's so he score. has it's terrible lately. Not gone over thirty in his last three games. Drummond's so weird to me. No. Uh, it's so hard to know, but they. Kem Birch is the only center. Who can who can rebound for Toronto? It's Nobody. Kem Birch is the only one. Chris Boucher is out tonight. Yeah. Birch Birch grabbed a bunch of boards the other night. Yeah, I wish he was on here. I like Ananobi a lot. Over? He's, he's been playing awesome. Yeah, 17 and a half. I don't know, because if, if he gets 17 and a half, Siakam's not going to hit. I got to yeah. gotta weigh my options. I'm going to take the Anthony Davis under, though. I feel really? like just, I think they're gonna blow Toronto out and just not even risk him getting injured. And just play him like twenty minutes or yeah. something. Well, he was on a minutes restriction until very recently. Schroeder? Is Bron back yet? I know they've been like hyping it up. Yeah, bro. Well, I don't know if he's playing. He tonight. might not play tonight though. Yeah. Wait, Schroeder won't play Sunday. Why do they have him listed? That's today. Let's just take it just in case. It'll <laughs> take push. The, that works. Please take the under <laughs> if you're gonna take it. Um, so yeah, so I guess only four options. I don't like. Yeah, let's see. I mean, you can't make any decision without knowing what yeah, LeBron's I feel like, you know, you're doing over, 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 over for all of them. Life's too short. And then whoever you think really is going to mess it up. LeBron. You know, switch that one out. Yeah, I think LeBron. Drummond would be the one that might mess up because it's too obvious. Ten and a half rebounds? Yeah, it's like too obvious. He should get 20. He'll probably finish with like nine. All right, I'm going to trust you. It's the worst decision you could have ever made. I don't know what I'm doing. Does chat know? Chat, do you know if LeBron's playing tonight? That'd be a weird game for him to come back and play his first game in Toronto. Or did he play already? No, he played against the Kings the other night and they lost. They kind of need, like, like they're they're, they're the six currently. It's a tiebreaker, but still. I'm sure the NBA wants him to be in a play-in game, though. Is Porter Jr. going to score tonight or what? I need him. Every yeah. time he touches Did you get it on him? Uh, yeah, I was over. Oh. And he only has what five points. He had five points really early on. Taking the over against the Knicks defense? I know. It's crazy. Need an assist. Let's go, Reggie. I have Christian Wood over too. He's been boarding a bunch. Yeah, if Reggie, just ball handler right yeah now. he just needs to score. Well, There's an assist. an assist. Thank you, Kelly. Ron's playing apparently. Um, Ron's playing. I took unders on both Lakers guys. Thank unders you, Chad. Both uh, Toronto guys. I don't know if I like AD under. I'm just not an Anthony Davis fan at all. Yeah. So it's just a personal vendetta right there. Yeah. I'm gonna go. OG over, Drummond under, and Davis over. Why wow, you're not going all out? No. It's not like you. I know. I mean, that's beautiful defense. Better move. New man. Shooter's the only one out tonight. Chat, what do you guys think? Anthony Davis, 23 and a half points over or under. OG, 17 and a half. Siakam points, rebounds, assists, 30 and a half. And Drummond ten and a half rebounds. Give us, glass. give us your best plays on under on under Dizzy. We're not under Dizzy, it's already a thing. Under Dizzy. What do we got? Wow, that looks awesome. I might go at halftime. Yeah, I'm gonna. I'm gonna too move. dedicated to my team. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Animal has officially now watched as much of this game as he missed. So, congratulations. Told you, I had, you know, had shit to do. Drummond projected 13.8 rebounds on sports line. Wow. Well, I just took the under on his 10 and a half, so that's cool. I'm kind of with you, though. Well, I, only because Braun's playing. That's it. He'll, he'll scoop up a couple of those rebounds yeah. and hopefully. Uh, and I, I really think they're, they got. They can't do this load management, you know, 30 minutes. Like, they got to start winning games. They can't be the sixth seed. 
No, if they want to actually have a chance of winning the title this right. year, yeah, they need to get to, and, and not even to just win the title. They got to get back in a rhythm to play at a high level. I know they well, think too. they think they're going to turn it on, right? But uh, I don't know. What's New York City like if you get a Nets Knicks series? Uh, a lot of very loud Knicks fans yeah. and a lot of Nets wins. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> But like Barclays will be all Knicks fans, obviously. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Wouldn't even be close. Uh, like if it, especially for like this scenario of like, like it would be a. So in years past, it's been like pretty. Wow, it's been pretty split fifty fifty, and like Knicks fans are just louder. But they would, but Knicks fans would intentionally try to take over Barclays because the Nets are like, think they're part of New York. They, they can have the better team every year; it won't matter. They're still not New York's team. Yeah. So. yeah. Did Nets fans do the thing at all, like Chargers fans did with the Rams, where they're like, "I'm not rooting for them after they were like ripped from us or whatever." Uh, or like, well, maybe like the New Jersey Nets. Yeah, like yeah. Fans. That's, what That's what yeah, saying. probably. Um, I. I don't think so, because they didn't move, like, far, right? No. I went to um, a Celtics-Nets game, you know, probably, I don't know, seven or eight years ago. It was yeah. obviously before they moved, and it was one of the saddest, like, basketball Nets? Experience. They were doing a <laughs> wedding expo on the third floor, like, during the game. It was like, people care so little about this that we'll just let these wedding expo guys set up sad. their booths during a game. I was like, what the hell is going on? RJ, 19 and a half. Uh, well, so the Broncos got an A-plus grade, so I don't know. For who? I forgot. It doesn't matter. It's, it's irrelevant. A-plus is an A-plus. Uh, I actually think the Jets had a really good draft, even though I don't like Zach Wilson. I don't think you can take a running back that early and get an A-plus. With the Broncos? Well, uh, I, I I unfortunately agree, but listen, I don't make the grades. So I just read them. So. <laughs> you don't? Can this loser score a little? Was he on underdog? Order? Yeah. 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 Cool. There it is. Heard you. We just need him to get uh, one more bucket by half. Who is it? Kevin Porter? Yeah. He's been playing well, right? Yeah. Yeah, he's actually the fourth youngest player to ever score fifty in a game. Fun fact. Can you name the other three? Is that what you guys were doing? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's literally what we did. We actually officially name the other three. Or do we just guess and no one say anything? Well, they'll they'll bring it up. Oh, was, uh, well, was it one of the questions on the? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Ray Allen could have done it too. R- ah. That's not good, RJ. Not good. We wanted those three points for the for the pick 'em. He's got eight, but like, come on, you loser! Score, you Reggie's loser. gonna kill me, and I already know it. Because if he doesn't have like nine by the first half, that's yeah. it. Like he's gonna finish. Come with on, nine. you scrub, loser. He's only gonna take two more threes this whole game. Got ah, shoot, shit. buddy. <laughs> no, that's just that patented Knicks defense. What teams do you think have the best draft? Jags? Uh, Jags with the, the, the ETN pick. Kills I hate me. the ETN pick. I hate that pick so much. You got Trevor Lawrence. <laughs> yeah, um, but like... That was does that expected. make them having right, a good draft? Right, right. Like, it, if you fell in their lap. Right. Um, yeah, no. Decided. Yeah, no, yeah. I, I, like I like the that a lot. Like the Lions had a had a good draft. I think Pene drop into them. Um, Monroe. Monroe St. Brown. Yeah, St. Brown. People like that. Why did he drop? He didn't really show too much. Like they only played like six games this year. Gotcha. Like I feel like he, isn't his biggest problem he can't like create separation. He's just like a contested slow. catch guy. Like a four, nah, he's, he's a good rubber. He's like Jarvis Landry. Really yeah. Like a four, six, yeah, Honestly, I don't even care about 40 times because I feel like game speed, like, like his game isn't predicated it doesn't matter. Like, game speed's so much different than some guy just running a f- freaking straight line. 
Yeah, how many times does anyone beat a guy deep for a 70 yard touchdown? Yeah. The only receivers the Lions have are those like straight line guys, Brashad Perry, Tyrell right. Williams. Right. Decided to switch it up a little bit. Quint- Quintez Cephas. He's super fast. They, they have to have the best or the worst wide receiver. I yeah. know that that's all they had going into the draft. Yeah. I'm surprised they waited until the fourth to do that. Yeah. And there's like no free agents left either. So. TJ Hawkinson's going to get a shit ton of targets. Yeah, him and uh, Swift are just going to get drunk in every single play. Swift's not going to make it. <laughs> Where? <laughs> Anywhere. He's just, just in the NFL. Guy. He's going to be going to be out soon. Based off what? I've been off. He's a Lions running back. It's like just it's a, it's a historical thing. Yeah, no, that's unfortunately accurate. I don't make up the, these rules here. It's just the way it works. But that's what they said about the Knicks, and now look at us. Yeah, well, it's New York. New York will always make a comeback. We're talking about you know, no offense. Detroit's kind of unfortunately he doesn't make. It's been going down. New York being an anomaly. <laughs> to the general rules that are made. <laughs> what are what are other? Josh Josh Verzi says, if the Knicks don't cover seven and a half, I'm unsubscribing and blocking all things BDG. <laughs> <laughs> Did you bet that yeah, lot? Yeah, when did you, you get that? He probably bought was that like live when they were points like, <laughs> on an NBA line. Will Mello forever be loved by Knicks fans? Yep. Oh, OG's out. Oh, out yeah. What well, sucks? Um, well, then Siakam over. Let's go. Will Melo forever be? Yeah, I kind of like that. Thirty and a half. Oh geez. A, Let's, or a, Nick? a Nick. Knicks fans want to give him a fucking statue. All right. Siakam over. Do we like Drummond under or AD something? I'm. I'm, I'm more confident in the Drummond under, which probably isn't a good thing. I just like Siakam. Pass it to Porter. Siakam over. Siakam. One more. One more. Shoot that. Oh, this Ooh. guy stinks. I like kind of want them to score a couple of points though. I'm gonna go A D over. I think I don't gonna. need to see Obi Top and play eighteen minutes tonight. Did you notice something though? Not Did tonight. you notice Peyton? What, not in the game? Just seven minutes. That's his new rotation. Doesn't get back in in the second quarter. Yeah, board. that's why I stopped betting him. It's glorious. And then I bet Rose the other night, and he sucked. <laughs> <laughs> and then I bet quickly, and he sucked. Come on, Porter. Give us one bucket before the half. He plays so slow. Yeah. He waits for the perfect time. He just never comes. Freak out. Josh said somebody compiled like 30 analyst grades for every team and combined the grades. And the top five best grades came out as the Bears, Browns, Chargers, Jets, Dolphins. Bears by getting field. Because of fields. Be, say that again. Bears, Browns. Browns? Who, who was there? I don't draft? even know who one player the Browns drafted. Okay, so no one cares. Uh, Chargers, which we I, I agree they did have a good draft, unfortunately. Jets, I guess. Yeah. And then Dolphins, which, I mean, when you have that many picks, I guess you kind of have to have a good draft. RJ, come on, baby. Ah, ah, one of those nights, huh? Shoot that, you bum. This guy will not, oh. like, with the shooting percentage, he's like two for eight, and he won't take half-court shots? What a loser. Shit. All right. What would finish with at the half? Damn. Oh, RJ had 10. Wood has 17. 17 total. Points, rebounds, assists. Uh... Um... Yeah, 32 and a half. I took him. Nope. Yeah. All right. I'm getting dinner. Carry the stream for us, boys. It's awesome. Nice look. All right.
you have an NBA team? I'm a Celtics fan. I liked OKC for a little bit, and then the news of the Kevin Durant trade just like got me off of them. But I'm like from around Boston, so I kind of had to stick with them. Uh, I'll be here. You said you're from Denver. Yeah. If I yeah, I'm not. I don't follow the Knights that closely, but they would they would technically be my team. Yeah, they look pretty good this year. Murray didn't get hurt. Yeah, that was a bummer. It seems like they could have gotten at least back to the Western Conference Finals. Great. Yeah. Is your composite low because like he's the top shot face in Argentina because you're Denver fan or a little bit of both? That was literally. I made a top shot video like a week into Top Shot in January and he wasn't even on the platform and I was just like I was spoofing I was spoofing like Top Shot bros and things they say and I was literally just like because everyone it was like Bogdan was going to be the face of the year yeah exactly so I was like who's just like a random one of these that actually no one has said but it sounds like something they would say and so it was Facundo being the face of Top Shot in Argentina and now he's actually become like very fun so I just keep saying that I think like all those 29 year old rookies, they just have like an automatic land base because they shouldn't be rookies at that age. Yeah. Well, he was, um, who was the other one like that too? He was on, uh, he was on the Nuggets for a little bit, but Rudy Fernandez was another super fun one. He was known as like some crazy dunker and he gets in the league. He's just like an average ass. And, and all he does is like shoot three pointers too. Uh -huh. the, uh, the Lakers had a few of those guys too, like 28, 29 year old rookies. They just like they never do anything, but they're supposed to be so skilled. It doesn't really translate yeah. when you're older than everybody and like can't move. And when like you're used to being the best player on the floor whenever you play and you're you know whatever the Spanish league. That's why I never got how Luca and like Lamelo just weren't consensus number one. Like they're playing grown men who are like skilled already. Dominating. Yeah. Like, Luke was pro at 15. And then they trade up for, like, Trey Young. They came yeah, ahead. I, I, I'm just expecting that to go number one overall. I know. I feel like everybody knew Edwards was, like, such high floor, or low floor, high ceiling. I can't like, stand that they that don't draft the ceiling. Just, like, get draft up. Yeah. First round upside, second round, just get like a Dylan. Dra you want to see upside? And the um, Knicks select Nidal Aquina Knox, like... It's terrible. It's terrible. I still, it was back when I was following the league closer, but I'll never forget that draft where the Timberwolves took Rubio and Johnny Flynn. Steph. Rubio. Other uh, stuff, Kirk. yeah. And you yeah. know who had the next pick? The Knicks. Yeah. Who did they go with? Oof. Tyreek Evans, was it? No, he went no. to the Kings, who actually yeah. won Rookie of the Year. Um... Was it? What year was that? Oh nine. Probably. Oh, nine. Trying to remember. I know. Animal. Who would the Knicks have drafted in the oh nine draft when they missed out on Curry? No. Flynn went to the Knicks. Yeah. Yeah. Let's see. Chat. Chat always knows. I actually want to say it was one of the picks that didn't completely fly. Oh, no. Chris Copeland? Close. Kind of looked like one of the hair. Jordan Hill. Jordan Hill, yep. yep. Uh, Brandon Jennings, 10th overall. DeMar DeRozan, 9th. You know what they say about Brandon Jennings. May or may not have scored <laughs> 50 points at the youngest <laughs> age. Hashim to be number two. UConn legend. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah, like think about it. Him and JJ Hicks are just running the pick and roll. Lawson's Lawson's out of the league and Drew Holiday is a about to get like hundred forty million in his bank account. Yeah.
Did Nick do a, a Super Bowl watch stream? Do you guys do that? No way. You have a newsletter? No. Yeah. Yeah. You like writing? Yeah. Not as my main thing, but I like it. I like it. What type of length? What's up? What type of length? Like long? Blog post, newsletter, or just like... Yeah, I like the newsletter. I like being... I like writing concise. Right. Trying to be as efficient as possible. Jack, we did just launch. Mm hmm I just kind of like our written past do list. Yeah. Yeah. That yeah, should be good enough to have And they launched it just for the pun. Under under dizzy. Jack's trying to make under dizzy thing. It's like the hip. It's like the hip version of under. The hit thing from what? Like Malibu's Most Wanted in two thousand three. Under dizzy. Late night under dizzy picks, <laughs> and and it's only ten p.m. sleep. How about under doggy style? <laughs> it's too obvious. Hello. How do you do? You're live. That was that was epic when when he did it. There's Hero. No, it's not. That was insane. I just had two different people recommend two different DJ sets at Miami tonight within seconds of each other. Random. Have like Eric a club? Prides is playing at Space. And Travis Scott is throwing a concert inside of the room. Wow. You have DJ on tomorrow? DJ yeah. Speak. We do. I'm going to do a randomizer draft for them. I think so. He's the DJ for the Vikings. Yeah. yeah. Conflict of interest. It's kind of like you doing basketball drafts. He better. I feel like. This is the kind of stuff we have to explore in life. He's also the son of a former player, Greg Anthony. Does oh? he do the Nick games? Uh, Greg Anthony. That's yeah. his kid. Yeah. I remember the, the kind of flip, because I grew up, I wanted to work for ESPN or whatever. And I would say, the, maybe it was like 2018 when I was talking to people and I was like, the dream of working at ESPN is just like, it's not that exciting, you know. So corporate, 
You gotta work yourself up. Yeah, I mean, it's also like the thought of taking the path of their mailroom equivalent intern. You know. Yeah. 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 It's awesome. Right. But they are adjusting, right? They recognize that. Um, Bleacher's doing a lot of fun stuff. Um, right. Right. Yeah. Where did you start? I started in BC. Oh, you started there. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. And then, this the yeah. Wow. I mean, I interned with the Rams. Like I worked in the scouting department for a year. Yeah. How was that? Like, do you like being on the team side of it? Did I want to do that? Do you like being on the team side? Um, I've, at the time, that's what I wanted to do. Yeah. Now, at this point. At this point, I've shared, like, way too much of my own opinion that they'd never hire me. Right. Um, but that's, that's exactly what I wanted to do. And then it was a lockout year, and it just didn't work out. Gotcha. I've been told, like, the team thing is obviously great, but... Area Scout's job is tough. Yeah. You're on the road for, like, 250 yeah. days a year, and you get paid not well. Right. But it's just, like, the reward of winning it all and, like, feeling like you had a part. But there's different wins now, you know. What if you were... Southeast Area Scout or Northeast Area Scout, whatever Maryland's in. All right. And like you were the one of the bikes. You find DJ on. Moore, yeah. Yeah, we should draft Stephon Diggs here in round four. Right. And he goes on to be like one of the best. Right. That must feel amazing. Yeah. Now you do it in fantasy football. <laughs> <laughs> you feel amazing. I was in there draft Eleven. So that was the Cam Newton's rookie year. Gotcha. With so who did the Rams Quinn. take? Took Robert Quinn. So that was when like the Falcons straight up for Julio. Yep. Ravens took Mark Ingram. He was the no, same. Yeah. In twenty eleven. Ravens must have been. That might have been the Kindle Terrence Cody draft, honestly. Which was like notorious. Mm. Might have been Terrence Cody. Was it? Can it wasn't Courtney Upshaw, that was later. Forgot about Upshaw. Yeah. I'm gonna get this right. No, it was Jimmy Smith. Yeah, that's right. It was Jimmy Smith. Another guy who dropped because of weed. Uh, I'm trying to tell you a story, but I cannot. <laughs> <laughs> off stream, off stream. Subscribe to the Patreon, Nick's Patreon. So they took Quinn. Yeah. They take anyone so else who's stuck. Like a, you know, a weird career, right? Up. Yeah. And so a lot of teams were scared off by that because they thought a hit to the helmet. Who knows? Yeah. Um, what pick did they take him at? Fourteen. He was really good. Right. And they had Chris Long already. Yeah. It was, a, it was a, Josh McDaniels was the OC that one year. Mm -hmm. So the most enlightening part was going into day two. Josh McDaniels wanted like his Gronk and Aaron Hernandez in St. Louis. And, you know, those are just two rare talents. Right. right. That. I feel like so many teams so tried to, so to copy so that. wanted to do it in St. Louis with Michael Hoho Manau Nui, who was just right. a journeyman. And this guy named Lance Kendricks. I remember Lance. Lance, Lance Kendricks yeah. wasn't anywhere on the board in round two. But the GM walked in and was like, we're taking him in round two. 
and then went and told the media, you know, like, oh, we took best player available, all that shit. Where is Animal? He's uh, ripping some stairs right now. <laughs> Probably more on brand than him watching the Knicks, to be honest. Oof. He's going through it. Nice play. Yeah, they like 16 wins. Ter- like, terrible. You know they lost it, like, they lost 17 in a row or something? Yeah, yeah it was crazy. Um, Everybody just got traded away from that. They didn't want to play anymore. Yeah. Uh, I have season tickets. Do you really? Yeah. Um, but I bought them, Jesus, I bought them, uh, before the KD, Kyrie, Zion, free agency, lottery, hoopla, so that was priced slightly in, so we got a terrible price, then they didn't get anyone, and, um, got... Oh my God! Nerlens Noel actually can't like catch a basketball. It's kind of bizarre. That's not what you want to do. <laughs> um, so we got back like thirty percent of the money when the final third of the season was canceled. Um, but we it, it was originally made as like really an investment. Um, and then I renewed them for next year. I think they. Drop by like twenty percent or something. <sighs> mine are. How much is mine? Sixty-five or seven k a ticket, a seat, lower bowl behind the hoop. But you can you can get in season tickets probably for two k or something, which isn't terrible. Um, but based off the prices that the tickets have been at over like the recent run for the Knicks, ticket the the get in price will be two times whatever faces. Especially when we get Dame. Owl? Uh, oh. oh my god, Porter. He's one of those guys I feel like everybody on Twitter I think Brett Coleman had him in his like tier three. Tier two or tier three. Never heard of him. There we go. Uh, I want to say like Missouri. It's, it's not Ooh. a big school. Emir, I'm Missouri definitely wrong. Smith, Smith, Iowa. Iowa. What's his like calling card? Is he athletic or something? Uh, separation. He's he's light, but. I feel like it's like a common theme. It's like this draft. Class. Yeah. <laughs> what was that? Um. I didn't even realize the Nick Ercolano with the KN, the New York Nick Ercolanos. <laughs> Someone wrote in the chat, Nick Ercolano is bike, but it's like Nick K-N-I-C-K. It's funny. Maybe not. You got it now? Okay, cool. Makes more sense that way. Christian Wood. Because I'm heartless. All right, Porter's up to 11. Rowan's up to 13. The boys are both. What are you tracking? Our uh, gaming partner, Underdog yeah. Fantasy. What, what, pickups. What, what do you need to have in this for game? Us to have a good in night? this game, we have uh, RJ to score 20, so over 19 and a half. He's at 13. We've got okay. Porter. Junior on the Rockets to score eighteen. He's at third. He's at eleven, 
and Wood over 30 and a half points, rebounds, assists. He's at 22. So everything's like perfectly on pace, but like it's going to be a sweat. Um, we got some other stuff cooking. And Reggie's going to kill me. Tonight. I know it. He just hit a three. Did he? Yeah. I think Rose is the one you guys are SOL on. Yeah. We'll see, though. Yeah. It really depends. Like, there you, there you go. go. There's the right hand. Let's go, Rowan. Nice move. Colin wants you guys to do a drinking game sheet, like for NFL games. What is that? Is that something you guys do? What is it? Like drink if this happens or something? Every RJ Barrett. Right. <laughs> You're absolutely belligerent by the end of the first. Yeah, green buff, green busted hard, Matt. He had seven or eight. Which is what? Nah. Yeah, I guess when Kelly Olynyk's like a feature player for you, things are not gonna not gonna go well. Do you remember? Oh, this is such a dumb story. Do you remember when that app came out that was called the Yo app, and you had friends, and all you did is send someone and just did a little audio notification of the Yo? <laughs> no. <laughs> Wait, what is you this? You might have dreamt this. I don't no, remember I this at all. I did not. Yeah, it was a social media app, and, the, and you had friends on it. I feel like Pete created this. I know. <laughs> <laughs> He's pitching it to us. It's a soft pitch right now. It's Only a soft utility pitch. utility is a little audio thing that says, yo. And so you just press it, and be like, and Nick would get the thing, yo. And so uh, it was around the same time I made my Instagram, and so I named it Yo Rosette, and now I'm just locked into it. And <laughs> now I have to explain you, Yo. Well, I mean... You do know you can change your username. You can, but there's brand equity. Um, is there, though? Because I, I actually I just realized like why over that. Okay. Yeah. So here it is. Initially, the application's only function was to send the user's friends the words yo as a text and audio notification, but has since been updated to enable users to attach links and location to their yos. Now this Content? Is links? What? Yeah. What was that? Uh-oh. Reggie Bullock. I told oh, you no. I was an animalist. No, he just uh, twists his ankle, looks like. Are you leaving? What do you mean? Yeah. You are? Yeah, I'll, I'll come back and see you guys. But I'm Wait, that's Merlin's. Uh, oh. Wait, I need your number because I, I want to get a Shabbat at some point. <laughs> yes, I think he's all right. He just got rolled up on. Yeah, I'll text it. The hell away from Alfred. Oh, Nerlens is hurt? Yeah. This also was not a charge. Just because you're a little boy? Yeah, that's not, I mean. Like, not physically, but maybe. Yes. Internally, he's yes. a little boy? Yeah, oh, no. No, he's physically a little boy, clearly. Little boy, look. Mm. Ah! <laughs> I will. Thank you. That is a strong move by R.J. Barrett. They're reviewing it or something. So on that play, Nerlens gets hurt and RJ picks up an offensive foul. Not ideal for anyone involved. This is not good. Good thing we got Nor uh, Norvell Pell. Oh boy, straight to the locker room. There he 
Es amazing. Rose is five boards and only two assists. That sucks. How many points does he have? Six. Thirteen? Yeah, I did not see him score. I've seen like two layups. I just said six to like hedge if he made one more. Animal, what was your record last year? Skyler wants to know. <laughs> everyone, everyone knows that. I, I would assume Skyler also knew that. <laughs> but don't forget, you know, it's how you finish. And I what won the last week of the season. So did you have a fourteen game regular season? Yes, yes, crazy. Okay. Yeah. Um, you gonna make more friends and get like a twelve team league or no? <laughs> Especially this past year. It's also a very exclusive league. Bye, Bye Aviv. Action Jackson says I'm bike. Yeah, when did you start uh, really involving that in the vocabulary? Years before it became a thing. It became like a thing. Before it was bike? Yeah. Well, did it ever leave? It never. Me and my friends like used to say it. Yeah. What? What? What is it? I, okay. Uh, okay. Uh, gotcha. <laughs> what would you have rather done? Be the creator or just make it cool as hell? I mean, it'd be really cool to create something that's like Yeah. Yeah. Oh, my friend. Actually, one of the guys who came over, one of the Dolphins kids Thursday night. Thinks he created uh, season S Z N. And wait, wait. Like, I just, out of I can't right. So obviously he didn't, and <laughs> he, uh, it correlated with uh, like Drake saying season, and he's like, "Yeah, I came up with that before he did." And we're like, "Uh huh, okay, yeah, <laughs> yeah." He's a little bit of an egomaniac. I mean, Peyton is just so bad. I was about to ruin this guy's career kind of like replied all of his tweets, but like, there's still another season. Like, look, like, look up. Look up. Look up. Is this guy dead ass? Dennis Gainwell just murdered Miles Sanders. <laughs> his big clout is ridiculous. Yeah. He posts like probably 20 times a day. It's bragging on Kelly and Drake. He told me to get on it. I posted like. My God, so many little boys on the Rockets. And the bonus already. <laughs> sure. <laughs> I actually feel like today has been. Today has literally been like food, drink, drink, food, food, drink, food. Yeah. Okay. We were going to get there at 10. Yeah. Yeah. You come whenever. Oh. No. Yeah. How far is it? Will we be able to get in if we go out town, or just should we? Sure, you know, yeah, I mean, if you no, know like the if bouncer, not, if you know the bouncer, <laughs> just, just get your wristband. Yeah. 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 I, I bet he said ten thirty because he was trying to give us a little more time. So I'm sure if we say ten, then he'll yeah. Be yeah. Yeah. Ooh. Oh. Okay. 
Yeah, I thought it was a nice move, but he double dribbled and missed the layup. What? We're up 11, baby. We're bike. (laughs) We're bike. You know the game's just going to hover around 17, right? Like for the whole time. For what? He didn't take it. Well, he might have actually. No, he's I didn't, but I mean, he's been quiet. Right yeah. Well, here you go. Maybe you could get the next 12 and a half or something. It is next 12 and a half. I'm so good at that, you, you know? Take it? I like it. You don't? Wow. I mean, that's probably a good, like, let's be honest. Oh, you trust. That, well, that should, be, that should, <laughs> should be fairly obvious. All right. Let's do it. I'm invested in the Knicks. Twelve and a half. Wait, weird. Uh, yeah, you got it in at twelve and a half. We'll see. Cause it, yeah, it should be. It should be. Well, this is. I got it. Oh, uh, all right. Yeah. Sorry, animal. I, I do respect you as a handicapper. Um, <laughs> Only on parlays, though. <laughs> Four or five weeks. Is that all you do is parlays? I like that style. Okay. Yeah, I hear you. All right. Cool. Sweet. And are we officially going live at noon? Do we know? It's at noon. Yeah. Noon to midnight. Cool. I think uh, Harditz is first. Schefter second. I like right at noon. Did you see the doc? I'm not the one that documented it. I should probably check the doc. Okay. Yeah, the one that Nick shared the doc. I'm pretty sure Schefter was first, but that was like a very hard thing to do. Randall's feisty. Colin, the Knicks are up 11 with 431 in the third. Should have been a jump ball. It look clean. Jack, you should ask Schefter about Lamar having to have stomach cramps last year. See if he knows anything. More have than we have know. you heard Harbaugh's I did. thing I on saw, it? I thought I saw that spiel. Was it someone's podcast? Yeah, I, I think it, he was actually talking to like some local coaches or something. Okay. But the story, right? Where he like so turns around, funny. We have no quarterback. Yeah, and then and like. Willie Sneed's like, I got it, coach. And, <laughs> yeah, and, he's like, no, you don't. Yeah, and, and Tucker, and Tucker, there you go. Back-to-back threes by Randall. It's such a good story. Tucker, or Tucker runs over, it's like 64 yards, and he's like, like, and he's like, and he's like <laughs> coach, I'll take, the, I'll, t- I'll take the kick. He's like, you think you can make this? He's like, I got a better chance than Willie does. Yeah. Yeah. And then Lamar That's comes awesome. in, he's the savior. Julia's starting to percolate. Really? That's that's dope. Kind of. Want to talk that talk? Talk that talk. Nerk. What are we doing back here? What are you? you what are you? You just ordering Gatorade, like raw Gatorade from an app? <laughs> <laughs> they already canceled your cigs on you. I feel like you should just take the L for the night. Wow. 
You were Eve gonna, has crossed three thousand dollars. Uh, smoking or just trying to get another pack? Six. Like I could just quit any time. Any Where are the odds that Pete is possible? He thinks he can just go cold turkey. He on did anything. it yesterday morning. No, you can't. You couldn't go cold turkey on cigs or or parlays. It's literally one day, and you're ordering cigarettes. You were ordering them. You haven't had a cigarette today. I don't need it. You proud of him, Jack? I am. I'm proud. But it, I, I was about to say I was proud of him, but then he started going into the I don't need them, I just like them type of yeah, spiel. That's and true. That's that bullshit we don't need. Yeah. If I was like a real smoker, I would have been like trying to get a pack all day. You did try one to as get soon as we got back. You didn't you have tried your phone, to get you weed from phone a, with you. Wait, 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 time, you out, time, time, out, time out, time out, time out. Didn't you try and buy weed from a random dude on the beach? No, he didn't try to. There's a big bag in his room. He got it. No, you that's didn't. Wait, you rolled it in a gum wrapper? Yeah. No, you didn't. That's some MacGyver. You try to shame him out of Yo, Animal MacGyver. Jesus. Animal instincts. Animalytics. We need to do, we need to do a segment, shit. Animalytics, where he gives his analytics on some ridiculous takes. You guys did an 8 for 60 or 2 for 100. He goes, I can't, I can't pass that deal up. Yeah. That's such a good deal. That is Animalytics right there. How old is Julius Randall? 26. He looks like he's 30. How old is his hairline? Yeah. That's like Brashad Perriman level. He's got to be like 34, 35. Honestly, I don't I have no idea what Brashad Perriman looks like. That's a good thing. Yeah. What are you doing, Pete? Um, I was writing the newsletter, and then I was going to Twitter to read, uh, confirm my biases about people talking about how cool Ethereum is. <laughs> is that part of the newsletter? <laughs> no, it just crossed 3,000. That was how everybody's tweeting about it. Uh. I don't think it's getting any higher. I'm probably going to sell mine tonight. Sell the top. Yeah. Sell the top. Selling the ETH Buy tonight. the bottom. Imagine being able to sell the top and buy the bottom. <laughs> Shit would be sick. Some people just have good a gift. Good luck. Good luck. Yo, you got to. Oh, that yeah. shit. There we go. That would be a. That Skirt! is sick. Nick's a bike. That's sick for the boys. Remember when Animal was bearish on the Knicks to close this game out? <laughs> you ever hear of an RJ and not, not Barrett? <laughs> You're definitely a huge RJ guy. We, we're a big RJ brand. Are you? Yeah. Like to an unbelievable degree. Uh, we made. I, I need to show them the the congrats Scott videos oh, that yeah. we made. What's the the championship week of like fantasy football? Yeah. Like uh, me and our editor Scott were going. Uh, we were playing against each other, and we'd like a week in advance. So I'd just be like, "Yo, congrats, Scott!" And then he'd be like, throughout the week, we'd just be like saying it back and forth, like, "Congratulations, Scott!" So like. We started getting a little bit more intense with it, like, you know, game yeah. by game, whatever, yeah. day by day. And eventually I reached out to just like 20 people, everyone on our team, like people that we knew on Twitter to have to. And I was like, yo, make a video of yourself saying congrats, Scott. <laughs> I made like a montage of him, sent him like a three minute long video clip of everyone saying congrats, Scott, to him. And then he did it and went overboard with it. That's why I beat his fucking ass. Yeah. Then he lost. Yeah. Congrats, Scott. You're out there. You did, right? Oh, that last night was nuts. Yeah, and they just scored like probably eight touchdowns combined. What game? Or what been. week? What week? Week 16. It was, uh, I'm not sure if the Bills played the Packers, <laughs> but like between those three guys, they scored like 100 something points. Yeah, I got screwed championship week. I suckered Steve into, <laughs> into depositing <laughs> <laughs> through email. That's what you call email marketing, baby. from Iceland. What? The uh, Skyra Icelandic water is the 8.88. It's delicious. I'll get you a bottle. You want a bottle? I'd like a bottle, yeah, for bedside. Yeah. A little bedside manor we'll bottle. Couple, we'll get a couple of bottles of Skyra. <laughs> what else we got over there? Let me uh, let me take a, a gander at that when you're done. Oh, oh, really? I mean, listen, if we're ordering cigs, let the boy smoke. I Unfortunately, um, you can't order cigs on uh, this, so... Where's this from? Like 7 Eleven or something? You got yeah, hit out of the and shit. What if I don't want what if I want snacks? Snacks isn't here. I, can call him. I want I want I don't want that snacks. <laughs> he won't answer, don't worry. Yeah. <laughs> you don't love me. Right there. Turn around, you mu Oh my god, what a sh one bug up. I'm just getting a whole bunch of shit. 
What's going on the what's going on your card? Give me a give me which, a crunch which bar. Is the, yeah, I got you. Wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> that's the worst candy bar of all time. Well, that's not true. Take a bike. <laughs> I'm not like actually getting in good faith. I can't put that in the cart. Why? I was got, like Twix is my favorite, but I was kind of craving a Twix. Right, I'll get you. I'll get crunch. you. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I'm getting like a whole lot of candy. Yeah. yeah. It's animals account, but it's also um, going to be on Nick's card. <laughs> <laughs> he has a company credit card. <laughs> does he? Yeah, he does. That's terrifying. I let the I let that the, like I let the king spend. I've literally only used it twice. What'd you use? <laughs> you fucking put that on the company card? <laughs> no, not again. Not again. It's not what I got you for. What up, VMR? I honestly don't know. <laughs> really big mistake, though. <laughs> honestly, it was almost like a comedic bit. Yeah. <laughs> like, yeah. it's like, but it's it, not that. It's like but it was activated when I got it, so. It's like, what? He asked for it in his contract negotiations this year. Uh, no raise, but we are going to give you a company <laughs> Uh, oh, this guy's got to look up. I mean, and one, but yo, I'm just when, are, when are companies going to stop making things that are white chocolate? You don't like Me. white chocolate? He was all over the, one of the, uh, the, those, the M&M them. cookies and cream bars. Not M&M. I was Hershey's like, Hershey's cookies and cream bars are their top five. Aren't those? Oh, the, yeah, those, those aren't bad. Actually. Those are great. Do, 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 do. Man, I'm going to get a weird candy bar. What about 100 grand? I kind of fuck with 100 grand. Okay, you're going to give me shit about crunch. You're going to 100 Did you see your grand. animal just go good choice right after I dropped that heat? That's not a good thing. I drop, look at his stomach. You tell me you, you don't got that. He's, he's bullish. He's bullish, <laughs> he's bullish, bullish on 100, 100 grand. grand. <laughs> Buy the stocks. How about the one guy who was bearish on limes? That was on tough. limes? Yeah. Our bo- what does that even mean? Our boy Fabio. Oh, bro. Fabio. <laughs> yeah. That guy was a liar. He was that out. was actually part of the fun portion of the night with Fabio, like trying to dissect why he was bearish on limes. He was out of pocket last night. Yeah, he was just, yeah. Julius for three. <sighs> All right. I mean, did we not time that to perfection? I know, and I just to think that someone was trying to talk me out of it that watches this team night in and night out <laughs> at least two and a half quarters of action. <laughs> yeah. You think Fabio got laid last night? Yeah, I hope not. For real. Let's yeah. not reward. <laughs> Let's not reward that childish <laughs> He was too good looking for his own like, good. You can't let, you know, evolution evolve to where that kind of behavior is rewarded. That would be poor. I'm not sure what I did, but I, f- I think it's gone. Did you delete the entire cart? No, nah, I, j- I hit the back button, <laughs> but it was like I put everything in the cart. Yeah, but I think Go back to whatever place you were at and see if it's there. I don't think it is. Shit. I think he just uh, undid everything. Hold on. Oh, no, we're good. <sighs> Wait, what day is it? I hope no one is dead. Nick, newsletter, want to push it? I can. T- Should I let Snacks write the brand part of the newsletter for tomorrow? He said he could tell a story. I'm not really sure what that means, but I'm kind of intrigued. Oh, he actually uh, probably has something cool from the Kentucky Derby. What the fuck does that got to do with the brand? It's the next brand. <laughs> it's the worst brand. Wow. ETH is pumping. Did you find the animal? Yeah. Okay. Where was it hiding? In the cart. Damn. Good hiding spot. <laughs> you think we should create a couple wheels for tomorrow? Yeah. Should we get up like semi early and like. Like six. That's, that's I feel like, kind of relax. <laughs> <laughs> I have a sheet with, like, a bunch of different, like, prompts, like, evergreen ones, stuff like that. I have some specific for BJSP, but, like, yeah, if we want to make any, like, specific ones. Uh, 
Who's DJ Ski? What's up? Who's DJ Ski? Um, he is the Vikings DJ. They music. Team. I'm doing the randomizer draft with him. I think at like five or six. Oh, cool. But I have like my generic kind of prompts and stuff. Um, but yeah, we can. I actually need to put. I actually need to play through that. Get some suggestions. Have other people come up with the ideas for me. Rowan. Order. See, like, Knicks are up 25. Back to back. Tomorrow. Where they got tomorrow? Uh, the Grizz. And in the midst, I mean, this is game one of a six-game road trip to end the season before the playoffs. At what point do you think RJ comes out of the game? And at what point do you think Randall will come back in? Or does he sit? I think Randall's done. I don't think they pose any sort of How many games are left in the season? 12-ish. Randy Uh, Jennings, wow. Bet none of y'all guessed that. There we go. No, we did. Oh, you did? Uh, Esports fan in the chat had it. Oh, someone had it. He said he scored 50 in his third game. Jesus Christ. Yeah. Stock price must have rose up higher than IQ. Uh, How many games do we have left? It looks like after this, the Knicks will have 10 remaining. Or, no, not even. Eight? Jeez. Look up. Look up. And one. Tibbs is pissed. See? He's out of his mind. Psycho. Has Kevin Knox even taken off his warm-up yet or not? Huh? Has Kevin Knox even taken off his warm-up? Uh, he, he got some random minutes the other game. Nurk just went over his rebounds. That hurts. The minutes apply. Jack, you were just locked in with like every sport in every game at all times. That's so correct. like what your life is like. That is correct. Yeah. Yeah. It's out of control. It's unfortunate. Halliburton. Had a bit. I think they had Buddy Heald at uh, 18 and a half. Yeah, he went over. 17 and a half, he had like 18 by yeah, that time almost. He went over. Basley had 12 at half, and he hasn't scored since. I might lose every pick him tonight. It's tough. <laughs>
Is Phoenix good? Top yeah. team in the league right now. For real? Yeah. Who they got? Chris Paul, Devin Booker. Oh, they got, yeah, okay, Chris Paul. And Eaton, Bridges, McCall Bridges, he went to Nova. Cam Johnson went to Carolina. A lot of scrubs. They're like lengthy wings that can shoot a little. Nice pass. Wow, nice catch. Wow. I feel like that was a terrible pass, to be honest. Yeah. <laughs> it's an unbelievable play by him. Rose. I mean, Ooh. he's just been spectacular for the Knicks. Was that a one for one, him for a DSJ? Uh, I think we gave up a second. Which, like, means nothing. Nothing. Like the 56th pick. Yeah. Quickly. Back to him. Nice. Nice. <laughs> All right, D. Rose. I mean, this guy is a sniper. I think that was his first three of his career. Fact or fiction? Fiction. Damn. I think he's hit multiple tonight. Animals bike. Bike again. Since Animal suggested taking the Rockets, uh, been they've been outscored <laughs> by 15 points. I don't think the Rockets have really You're scored. <laughs> Four assists. He's got four? Just need one more. That's not bad. I think Dun -dun. everything else missed, though, so it doesn't matter. Hard needs one more. Twelve needs a... Uh, Twelve and a half needs one more basket also. Yeah. One, one, one here. One assist, one point, one basket. Yeah, Beasley is... I have Jimmy over 21 and a half, RJ 19 and a half, Derek Rose four and a half to win 300 bucks. Yeah, I'm sitting on a lot of edges right now. I think I had Lillard plus two, with, uh, Tatum, that did not work out for me. Team at 26, Tatum at 33. Do 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 Anybody texting if they want something? I don't need to say. Yeah, I took a screenshot of a lot of them, but I didn't get it. I sent, I sent, the only thing I sent out, I sent out a visor today. Somebody. I went to the wrong person. Yeah. I think I sent it to myself. Always no, fade animal. Do you have a visor? Hmm. Just yeah. I don't ever Max like rock that, animal. so visor is just. Visor actually might be the move because I do have a lot of hair going on, on the top. The big dogs one? I was wondering where that came from. Do, 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 do. Being too selfish. Yeah, you're a point guard. There you go. I'm there. feeling it right here. This is it right here. Quickly to RJ. Oh, How no, RJ? No, RJ? He's out there. RJ's no. Number RJ's nine. at the top of the screen, right? Yeah, number nine, right? Yeah. We need one more bucket for RJ. I need an assist. Badly. Quickly's not passing us. 
Got a big on him. Oh, Shit off the nice glass. Nice. So good. He wasn't a freshman, right? Out of Kentucky. No, nah, sophomore. So he was like kind of young for being a sophomore. Yeah. Got him. Good D, Obi. Snacks' is, is fucking Twitter feed is incredible. He's watching the game. This is bully basketball, all <laughs> uppercase. Julius Randle is the MVP. I don't disagree. Yeah. In terms of most valuable. Yeah. The actual definition of most valuable player, to me, you take them off the team, how's the team going to do? Yeah. What's their value to the team? But... But if you put Jokic on the Knicks, are they better than? That's an interesting way of looking at it, you know. I would look at it just if you take Jokic, Jokic right. off right. Nuggets. Oh, Emmanuel. Steph Murray, Michael Porter Jr. There's other guys. Filled it up. Who He's, shot that quickly? Yeah. From nice from the edge. Yeah, we're done. Oh, the black hole at this point. Hit that! Hit oh. that! Are you fucking kidding me? What they call? Oh, he was out of bounds. Oh, cash, cash. Yeah, from the logo, kid. Derrick Rose is top five all time. Oh my god, corner. I love that. Was that from Rose? Good lord. Just catch that shit. Yeah. That made Animal lose a parlay. Fuck. Tibbs is just, I mean, this guy's out of control. The Yo, if you have season tickets, you get the, you have like, uh, what's the playoff deal? What's the playoff deal? As in like, if you have season tickets, you just like are you, in, you get playoff you, tickets too? You got to pay for them, but you get them at face. Okay. Yeah. Didn't exp- okay. the, the transportation around here is out of control. So it's always like that, yeah. Um, Ours came shockingly fast last night. I went with, like, not go to Caesars. It's okay. No, it was, okay. It was it was okay. huge <laughs> dub. Did you have Jamaican? Huh? Did you have? Yeah, I'm probably going to shower. Jack, what do you mean? I feel like our shit took forever last night. Nah. Oh, okay. We tracked it. We literally tracked it every yeah, five yeah. minutes. It took, it took like an hour, no? Yeah. Yeah. That's quick for Uber Eats, no? For here, for, maybe. For where we're yeah. located. For where we are, yeah. yeah. I'm it's just like used 20 to minutes like, to get an Uber. I'm just used to New York where it's like eight minutes. Come on, RJ. Oh, my God. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, some of the top shots. Oh. This is like generic. Fuck. These are like private dishes. One more shot from you. One more point from So the Discord. We need like. Every how many assists do you need? Oh, they need one more assist. We need one more point from RJ. We need like one more point from Christian Wood and like two points from Porter Jr. Yeah, and then Yeah, except look at the score. It's a nightmare. Come on. Come on, come on. No. Okay. I guess that's a good pass. <laughs> You got bots going in there make and sure stuff too? They make sure everyone uses promo code Keith in here. <laughs> <laughs> so, you know, a little army. Don't foul. Don't foul. Come on, RJ. What about a rose to RJ? That would be ideal. Shoot that. <laughs> no. I mean, if you're not going to guard quickly, he's going to light you up. Nah, he's got like 12 or something. Yeah. 
You're telling me we're going to put up 130 points and they're terrible. Just get to the get one free throw here. Come on. Use it. Use it. Yep, yep, yeah, yep. There you go, there you go. Very minimal stuff. Like yeah. That. All right, Rose is in the bag. And then I, like, I, I mean, and then I just have like, oh. someone set up this thing for me where like people. We need it right here. Wait, Wait so my, my RJ play is tied to CB3 over 29 and a half. He has 18 points, 11 assists. Zero rebounds with three minutes to go. That's kind of what I've been doing too. Like, no, in oh, in different games. Yeah, yeah. They have the different Is how many like boards? Click on no, no. None. Their tag. So like he, so he's, he pays for both the VIP, the club. Who was that? Is uh, do we think Wood and Porter are done? He got pulled with like. Huh? Uh, yeah. Of, uh, I saw New Orleans was trying to check in for whatever reason. Or maybe it was Norvell Pill. Um, yes, exactly. So oh, this shit. Was like DFS, so they started at like Fish and then moved to Oh, Halliburton got hurt. And then like whatever. But then I sent this. Six assists. Five. Kind of overlit. The line was so seven. The, so I wow. Like Marvin Bagg is 23. That's like his best game. The uh, moderators. Right, bro. Like the guy who bought the 69 Mans has his own. The VIPs, man's playing on our ship chaser is this. And then these are just like the random tiers that people can move up based on how much they And you don't mind that they that Jimmy. Yeah, that's just the bomb. I mean Jimmy I could change like the points. name of and cool. stuff like this. Jimmy Butler. I don't even think he's um, playing anymore, they're winning too big. But yeah, just right just like that little gamifying stuff. I don't remember. Really like. Eighteen. You sharp. You did say that when I was reading out the uh, No, because the you said he's been going for twenty eight thirty. Good for an eighteen. I need to like tail only Tony's baseball picks. Yeah. Those are like the only <laughs> things. Oh. Alburn. Oh. Yeah. Did he get hurt? Terrible. A leg injury? You watch on Twitter? Yeah. Yeah. Hyperextension. He went down real quick. Damn. It's not pretty. There was like nobody near him either. Just yeah. Like pointless behind the back. Yeah. yeah Good shot. Kevin. Kevin knocks that past that shot. Kevin. Norvell. Two left hands. Come on, Norvell. Nice pass. This, <laughs> what is going? How was that not back? <laughs> what did he do? <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's actually why I came down here was for the random women walking in. My head. <laughs> What is this for, like, 124, 117? It's hitting every single thing. That was three. Rose! We need to miss it. <laughs> oh, wait. Man, that bet was a smash. Rose Thanks, Rose Jack. <laughs> yeah. Thanks, animal. It's the opposite of what we need. Past that. Oh. That's a heartbreak. Kevin Knox. He's out. He's definitely out of the game. Wow, that's pain. Did we ever get the answer to that? Yeah, it was Brandon Jennings. Yeah, yeah someone in chat. If it had to be anybody, it was going to be Kevin Knox. Of course it was Kevin Knox. He hates me. <laughs> we 
Who's 11? Is that Dotson? Uh, no. It's Frank. Is it? I don't think I've yeah. ever seen him play. I just like Frankie. Yeah, that's good. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, it's it's hard if it's like DJ to BS. Okay. But then that. Yeah. Well, or how about no? How about how about DJ Shark? Uh, yeah. Have to draft a DJ. Yeah. Who? There's DJ a couple. Right? DJ Moore. Yeah. DJ Dallas. Hey. Yes. Hey. Okay. All right. Thank you. Yeah, that's a good one. What about first? What about like Duke Johnson? Yeah, we yeah. might have or, to open it. Or uh, some either the initials DJ or their actual <laughs> names DJ. Dick Jonas. And then, like, those are fun, but also too like people love like when Nick came on, then Nick literally had to just tuck his shirt in twenty times before he could he could draft. So like just random challenge stuff. We have to do. Are you are you gonna have? Must have been pretty late though. Uh, game had thirty something. Last minute. Awesome. When are we thinking of pulling this up for each person or? So I was like, I think it. So I was kind of talking about this with those guys too. I mean, with like DJ Ski, it makes sense because he's like not a hardcore fantasy guy. Like That's Silva and Harditz, come on. Like people want those guys as their actual. They both got like shin splints on like the draft. So like I don't think the wheel makes sense for them. I think it's for like the guests where it's like. They don't have like ADP takes, right. and you just want it to be silly and have fun while yeah. they're drafting. I literally hate the Celtics. Um, There's no redeeming qualities there. Such a Brad stupid. Stevens didn't even help him <laughs> watch. Watch him. Do you see that? No. Uh, Jalen Brown, Jason Tatum colliding in the last minute. But like, are I they hurt? Like, yeah, both of them just limped off the board. They're both on the board. It's just nice. That was like the Peter Like this is just for like DJ Ski. Number 33 is really struggling to dribble the basketball. <laughs> so we're not drafting a team. <laughs> yeah. The other thing is, too, I mean, what sh- it's finding the balance because these drafts go fast, right? Like, 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 yeah, and, and, and like the other thing the that screws you is when you're on turn. Yeah, it's because like you have to do back-to-back <laughs> no Like, if you're in the middle, you have, like, some time to spin and to figure it out. More and more, will you get the over, Josh? They're rooting for RJ, too. RJ Hay. We're good. Yeah, it familiar. Matter, His last name is Lamb. Derek Rose. Yeah. I think Jimmy Butler also killed him. I actually blame Kevin Knox. It's not a bad one either. Must draft a player who has tweeted. I would send us in a fucking scurry. That would be right. I like that. I wonder if there's an NFL Siakam player. Siakam has Twitter five points in one minute. According to Someone's my phone. Made that. Yeah. Siakam yeah, has five points in one minute. I'll take that. CB3 just pulled. Uh, Caruso starting. Oh, must you have to play with less hair than Matthew? <laughs> Uh-huh. Um, I, don't, I think it's always like weird with them. I think they reached out to him, but Jeremy's always like, he wants something. Chris. <laughs> Chris Paul got a rebound with 15 seconds left. Yeah, we got like a minute left in this game anyway, but. Uh, Twelve and a half seemed to be a lock. Look at that. I'm surprised. I mean, who would have thought? Who would have thought? Theo. Bullock did not hit. No. Theo Pinson. He's uh, like li- No. Well, he actually won a championship at Carolina as a starter. Got to the league. G League uh, champion or MVP? I think champion. And he's like a legitimate cheerleader. On the bet, but like Knicks fans want to like max, want to give him a max contract. Like that's how that's how. <laughs> yeah. We've been dying to pay a player for, <laughs> for yeah, a while. Really. Yeah, <laughs> they just yeah, want it right. <laughs> they literally want to just sign someone to the max. It's a it's a feeling that you know not every team gets to experience. Oh yeah. 
I can't believe Kelly Olenek's still playing. Oh, let's see this. Kevin. Oh! <laughs> let's be honest. Did you expect Kevin Knox to finish that? He. Let's, no. Yeah, but like, no one cared. No, no one cared. Kenny Martin Jr.'s had two really nice blocks today. Ugh. That's really like his fun. whole career right there. Sad. Who's? Kevin Knox. Yeah, his he career was unfortunately over when he like wore the three fort- good games. He in wore like the Fortnite preseason. Suit. Did he pull the foul on that? I guess he had a couple good games in the preseason, and then that was it. Never again. I mean, we took him over Michael Porter Jr. Nerland's got pick. hurt, but we could use that guy over there for some depth for the Knicks. What, what's my guy who just walked in the door? Six foot ten. I mean, oh yeah, definitely. You could use a backup no, center at him. the Mecca. That's what I'm saying. Should we have? We should put him through the no, presser. Huh? FB God. Six four, six six. Got to be Let's six go, six. Theo. Jeez, I'm sitting down. Kevin. Good for you. Oh, it's awesome. Yo, that's crazy. You're gonna. This is how you know how I feel. Well, actually, you have a brother that's six seven. Yeah. You guys, there's a there's a man that just walked in. He's six nine. It's, it's freaking awesome. There's also this man is pretty tall too. So He's six seven. Yeah, you gotta be the at Knicks, least six the Knicks seven. The next could use some wing help, Jeez. and it just walked through the door. Wait till I stand up, guys. <laughs> we yeah, they wow. might look how small they make Mike look. How small Mike looks. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> so cool. Uh, dude, I, I, you don't get it. Like, I literally grew up with, like, nobody. Like, the, my dad is the tallest person I know. is six feet. Really? Like, that's it. Yeah. Well, you, like, came in, like, all six four in my house? Like, hey. No, I didn't really. I didn't stand up next to him. It's because my mom's very, very short, so. It's actually um, Arnold and Danny DeVito. Oh, my God. It's pretty crazy. Two, two le- legit All right. giants Good win. walked into this house. Wrap it up. What's, yeah. the, what's our outro? Um, I'm just, like, super guy. Like, every, like, two humongous giants just walked in. I need to. He's I need to, He's I, I, I love it. I need, to, <laughs> I need to know more what it's like. He's a size team. Yeah, yeah. I'm all about mass and just being big, except I never got there, so I idolize those that do. So, you know. Yeah. So, yeah. Uh, whatever, you guys. This is a, The next stream's over. I got, I got business to take care of. Um. <laughs> uh, use uh, promo code uh, Pete and uh, <laughs> promo code Feet and... Uh, Sign up underdog.com. What is it? Underdog slash underdogfancy.com slash BDG. <laughs> slash sharp. And you will use my code. <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> we got, we're getting feet. feet is owed a million dollars in affiliate dollars. <laughs> and we don't know who to pay out. What's up? What's How up? are you? Oh, the tall people? <laughs> I'm taking away... Uh, Dude, like, I'm like, legitimately... I'm taking away your credit. Overwhelmed. Are you yeah, shook yeah. right now? Yeah, I just always wanted to be 6'2", and then... 6'9". The 240 yeah. hit, as you said yesterday. The 6'2 never came. So it's unbelievable. All right, guys, we got, I got shit to do. Uh, thanks for watching. It was real fun. Go Knicks. Uh, we got Grizzlies next. Grizzlies next. We're Grizzlies gonna beat tomorrow night. Grizzlies tomorrow night. All right. Which one? Anyway, you want to end it on the, uh, that one over there? I knew we'd do it. <laughs>